Hello! In this video I want to show you how I draw a head from different angles. It's still rather difficult for me because I'm still a beginner. The basics are that every character has facial features which make him recognizable. So it's important to observe the character design and take a look at the main characteristics. The main difficulty is to make the character recognizable even when he's performing different expressions. As you can see I struggle a lot. I think it's very important to be self-critical. I try to take care about the hairstyle, the form of the eyes, the ratio between mouth, nose and eyes and much more to make the character recognizable. After a while I take a break and come back later so that I can see more mistakes which I did. Okay, from this point I try to comment freely, so I don't read my text. So. I try to lower the eyes a bit, because if the eyes are way too high, uh, she looks different and older, so that's one point um, I take care about. Yeah, the ponytail. Uh, that one was rather confusing. Now I look at her collar, make it a bit wider. Ah, I always hate open mouths, so I like them more closed. Ah, this was a very difficult angle. It took me about oh, two and a half hours. Now I'm blending in my webcam and um, you can see Kodama Himigami. I used her as a reference. She is almost perfect because she has twin fields. It's not a ponytail, but the head form is almost the same. I also used her as a lightning refer li lighting? Li lightning? Uh, something like this. Reference and I think it's lighting. And yeah rather helpful if you have such a figure so you can take a look, observe and correct your mistakes. Another thing which I did was to post um, some of the process in the forum. So I've got critic and then I could correct it much further so things that I didn't see. Here I put a, a small bulge in the lower lid so before they were flat, now the one is not so flat anymore. I think I will yeah, cut it in while, um, before and after, so that you can see the difference. Okay, now I try to explain what I mean with the bulge. Um, she is um, from, a, we see her from a warm's eye view. And the problem was that it looks here, the face looks rather flat. This was because the uh, lower lids um, weren't at an angle, so they were rather flat. Here I indicate the warm's eye view just by putting the lower lids at an angle, basically like this. And this one is basically the bulge which I meant. Okay. I think three angles are enough for this RPG Maker face set. Um, if you want to see a certain angle from her, um, I could try to explain it also, but you know, my English isn't good and I'm not very good in explaining. Yeah. So, wow, cool. 